guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here i'm a homeschool mom to an only child going into fourth grade um, today i want to show you kind of what i came across that i'm going to incorporate in different ways throughout my homeschool year um, to incorporate some type of history um, so if that is something that interests you please keep watching Jessica over at the Waldock Way. I don't know if I saw it on her channel or on Instagram or something, but I was obsessed. I had to get them all. So I'm just going to show you. So I just got done laminating um, and cutting a few of these, but if you go check out her website, and I'll link a link down below where you can get these. Um, but she has all types of what she calls discovery decks. So I absolutely love the idea of this and I may even find other ways to add onto it myself. So this is basically going to give you roughly 20 questions, I believe, of a topic. And she has all sorts of topics on there. So this one is um, all about animals. So it's going to have what is included in it, um, the questions that are included. It's, it's like common questions, but it's also to make your child, um, like if they're curious about something, it's an easy way for them to dive into that. And then there is some uh, interesting fact pages like that they learn and stuff to fill out. You can use, choose to use that or not. So, and then it comes with the question and then it has a simple QR code on it. Do animals fart? Um, I think any kid would be curious enough to look up the answer to that. So there's tons of different um, questions like what is the most dangerous animal in the world? How does adaptation in animals work? How do some animal function without brains? um can animals laugh so you're gonna get a ton of like random animal questions and so that is just one of them i picked up a bunch um i picked up how it is made and so i just cut all of the questions and laminated them i also picked up how were games invented video games and or um interesting inventions but video games is one of them uh so it has a ton of different questions about interesting inventions and they're all like set up the same i also got i don't even know if i printed them all to be honest that i got i just printed a few um i also got the mythical creatures one so it's going to have tons of myth mythical creature questions uh where did werewolf smith come from what's the science behind vampires what's the history of dragons what is a gorgon oh i don't know what that is okay um did any mythical creatures ever exist so she also has one um all about the presidents i know this is an election year and i know a lot of people are going to be focusing on presidents and stuff like that as we come into this next school year so my thought process behind this is to have her pick one or two of these a week to do either before school to kind of get us motivated um or just like ready and it could easily be something that may spark her interest on something and that's kind of like my intent behind is I really need her to find her love of learning again and that is to be curious and she's a very curious kid so I'm hoping some of these will stick out for her and she'll want to learn about them and then we can go down rabbit trails should we need to now we're also planning a trip to um it's a very big trip it is 
hopefully I don't die, but it's, it's, it's a lot. It's a road trip. So we're going to Illinois, to New Mexico, through Colorado, to South Dakota, to the Badlands, to Mount Rushmore, and then home. So it's a long trip. We're going to be gone for almost two weeks. And my thought process is she can pick out one of these discovery decks and that is something that we can do in the car um, as a way to learn while we are on the road because it's going to be in august so it's very close to our start of school and i don't want to have to take off for a vacation that close to starting um, i'm not saying that i'm going to bring all of our curriculum but i need it to count for something um, i need her to be bringing books in the car and not just you know screens and stuff like that so i think this gives a really good um car activity like you can make a game out of it you know if you hit an hour on the road or every three hours on the road um hit a discovery deck card uh and then the whole car can discuss it or laugh about it or whatever um and then see where like the conversation goes or the rabbit trail or whatnot so I'm really excited. If you like these things, please go check out Jessica over at the Wild Aquaways website. I, like I said, I will have a link down in the description box. So that is it, my friends. Uh, let me know in the comments, what do you think about this? And to kind of go down these fun adventures outside of like curriculum. All right, I will see you in my next video.